Well guys, today's day of the D, the D day. I'm going to install my headlights. So let me uh, get one out here. Um, yeah, get this one out right here. Here you go. Here's here's the unveiling of the headlights. Pretty sweet headlight. So, <clears throat> I think what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna do one side first, and I'm gonna put uh, these lights in there, and just do one headlight, and do kind of like a comparison. So, anyway, uh, yeah, because these are it's got the waters. So, yes, they do make blinker fluid apparently like the day you ever never thought they would make uh, exhaust or bearing fluid well now they got diesel exhaust fluid it lubricates your bearings and now you got blinker fluid anyway so whatever you got to take this grill off so it's three bolts one two somewhere in here three four four bolts sorry if I said three you got to take these off uh, there was one there. Um, this is kind of cracked. But whatever. I'll take these off. These little grommet things. Take those off. Take these off. You unsnap it in here. I'm not going to go through the whole process of doing that on video. So, um, But anyway. So I'm going to get to it. And uh, you guys get to watch. So uh, I do have a lot of projects for this weekend for the truck. For the new 4th gen. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, uh, you'll know I got, or, or YouTube, I got some, I got a lot of stuff for the truck. I also have, I just received, I did not know when they were going to ship it, but this is the crank, crank, crankcase, uh, ventilation filter. Um, I bought it on eBay and I don't know what happened, but the guy shipped it via uh, Amazon so whatever I guess Amazon's taking over the world so anyway I'll be doing this it's a fleet guard that's the number CV 52001 so I'm gonna install that too because I don't know when this one's been done it could have just been done I don't know it could have never been done let me get you guys set up here and uh, tear this all down and then uh, go from there. So anyway, what I am doing is I am putting some dielectric grease. You read that? Dielectric grease. I'm just basically putting it around a couple spots on this gaskets. And then taking my finger, rubbing around, just trying to get a good, a really good seal so that these new headlights don't have the same problem just trying to get a really good tight seal so and then just assembling them over here bring it over here 
So I'm just assembling them there. I already got the the passenger side one done with the LEDs in there. Yeah, I know. I should have done uh, more planning on this, but I didn't. So, oh well. So, let's see. So I got grease on this one. <clears throat> it's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, you got a big hole. You got a small hole. So this one's going to go in here where the small hole is. Just line all these up. So I'm tucking the harness in here just so it'll go in. See what I'm doing. But trust me, I am doing something. Um. <clears throat> I'd have to end up using the old headlight bulbs. Okay, there we go. Just due to the fact that these might not work. And then I'm taking some dielectric grease on here. Putting it on here, put it on here. Yada 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 yada. So a little bit. Just putting it in there. So that'll hopefully have a good connection. It does say plus minus plus minus plus minus. So, so yeah. Anyway. Just making sure that they snap. Something does not want to snap. Snapped, tucked it in, <clears throat> and then I'm taking these caps too. Same thing, just putting some dabs of this on here, going around it, round, 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 and then uh, yeah, I'm sticking this on. Clocking it that way, and then hopefully it'll seal and these won't leak. So then you take this one, same thing, O-ring. Just gonna put it around the little O-ring. I think you guys can see. If not, I'm sure there's millions of videos out there how to put light bulbs in. Maybe they don't do them the same way, maybe they do, I don't know. Take this one, line it up the way it goes, stick it in there, twist her around, Need the harness, same thing, put some of this on here, <clears throat> excuse me for clearing my throat, been moving rock and dirt all day. Right, take this, find the negative. Negative is always going to be black. I'm assuming, I'm hoping. So, trying to get that seal, the seat in there. Oh, that's what I didn't do. Nice. And then the light bulb just pops out apparently tuck this in there spin that around take this hokey pokey same thing I already emailed this guy about this, these lights because like I said the paperwork says 
one year warranty but on the ad it said five year warranty which is one of the reasons why I bought them because I figure longer the warranty the better the bulb but I don't think that's going to be the case so especially considering Let me, let me do something real quick. Off camera. I'll be back. Alright guys. So, it's supposed to have either multiple holes in here or it's supposed to have multiple holes in the light. But, being that they're cheaper than they said they were, I have to make my own holes. Whatever. Get what you pay for, I guess. But they were all pretty much the same price, and I don't know. I reached out to a, comp a couple companies to see if they would give me a deal or or even just sell me some. But they wanted me to find vendors nearby, whatever. Anyway, let's see if that's better. Oh, look at that. Amazing. Anyway, throw the seal in here. <laughs> oh, that's a stupid light bulb. I can tell it came out. Oh, well, maybe it didn't. Anyway, not the greatest design of light bulbs, but they are what they are. Um. Anyway, that's that. I'm just gonna put some dielectric grease in here, hang this off, open up this. This is for the blinker and side marker light, whatever you want to call it. I don't know why they got all this tape here. Uh, whatever. So far, headlights, I like the light bulbs. So, anyway, let's go uh, get you guys over here real quick. Alright guys, I don't know if you can see it or not, because it's blinding, but we got regulars, and then you got high beams. I'm trying to flash, flash, high beam, so I think, I think we're uh, good, so let me get both of them in and check it out i'll be back all right guys that is it for this video you'll see more tomorrow or the next video um i'm having an issue with the high beam on this side um yeah i don't know what the deal is but we'll figure it out 
I'll probably have to contact the seller on the eBay and uh, yeah go from there I don't know what to do so some of the parts are gone and finished also I had to fix my kids windshield washer it was leaking out the motor so hey guys that's gonna be it for this video make sure you guys comment subscribe like give me a like let me know what you guys think about the headlights like I said I'll show you guys them uh, on the truck in the next video um, I'll be doing the delete kit here uh, tomorrow and hopefully exhaust tomorrow or on the next video alright guys thanks for watching later